Now for question B, I would uh, give you time if you haven't watched my previous videos, you can read this question. Uh, I have done a, a video on question A. For question B, uh, if you watch that video, you can do question B quite easy. I'll give you the answer. The answer for question B is hash has avocados. Okay. Now for has, I'll work out the answer. The probability, okay, the probability that it is uh, weighs more than more than 440 is about 4%. And the probability that uh, that Hopkins, uh, no, the the F brand will be more than is 13 percent, and the probability that Hopkins will be more than is 6 percent. Okay, so most or least likely to be more than 440. The answer is has. Okay, so let me do question C. If 10% of each varieties, variety is underweight, which variety has the heaviest underweight fruit? So let's start with Hess. For Hess, for, let's start with Hess. We want to find which variety, 10% of the, each variety is underweight. So let's draw a normal curve. So this is the question of inverse normal. So the mu for has is 325 grams and standard deviation is 65 grams. So 10% are underweight. So 10% is this area. Uh, so the area is going to be 0 0.1. Okay, so the left area is 0 0.1. So you've got the mean and standard deviation, you can directly find the value of x by going to inverse normal. So to first go to normal, so stats, then I want to go to distribution, normal, and inverse normal. So the area that we need to enter, the left area is 0 0.1, standard deviation is 65, and mu is 325. So the x value is going to be 241 point. So you can see the x value is 241.7, 241.7, let me find, it is right, 241.7 grams. So anything which is, oh, this is roughly 242 grams. Okay, so 242 grams. So I'll write here for hash, anything below 242 grams is underweight. Okay, so let me use a different color. For the F uh, brand, okay, so let me slightly scroll up. So for the F, again the same process, the mean and the standard deviation will change. So the mu is 400 and the standard deviation is 35. Again, you want to find how much, what's the weight for uh, this brand to be considered as underweight. So 10%, the area is 0 0.1, okay, and you want to find the value of x. So again, uh, standard deviation and mu will change. So standard deviation is, is 35, okay, and mu is 400 and that is 355.1 okay so that is so for this it is 355 grams okay you can also say 355 grams okay rounding so anything less than 355 gram is considered to be underweight and directly for this I'll directly do now so here the mean and standard deviation would change. So mean standard deviation is 80 and mean is 4, 315. So that would be 202.5. So you can say 213. 213. Anything which is less than 213 is considered to be 
underweight. The question is, which variety has the heaviest underweight of, which is the heaviest underweight, which is the F brand. Okay, so you can say this is the heaviest uh, variety or heaviest underweight variety. Anything which is less than 315 is considered to be underweight.